Washington County's Fur Road Bridge, located in District 5, is undergoing a much-needed facelift. The bridge is the main access point to Delta City. Before you guys got started on this bridge, uh, what, was, what was the condition? Uh, it was a timber bridge. Um, some of the timber piles had, had failed, and we tried to replace it, but it was beyond repair. So the county funded um, $1.2 million to replace the bridge. IMS Engineers, the county's appointed engineering firm, designed the bridge. Engineer Lorenzo Anderson explained the scope of the design. We designed a concrete bridge, as you can see. Um, it has concrete piles, concrete caps, uh, pre-stressed brick beams, uh, around 170 feet long. Anderson said contractors are in the process of doing the concrete decking for the riding surface. It'll benefit the citizens because they don't have to uh, do, a, do a detour around two, two miles. So uh, once we complete, we'll do asphalt for the approaches and it'll help the citizens out. Greenville native and IMS engineer Jaron Collins is serving as the inspector for the Fur Road Bridge project and shed some light on what that looks like. Uh, just going about the day-to-day -day processes and make sure they go according to plan, according to the scope of work that we agreed upon. And some days are better than others, but that's why I have Lorenzo here to help me out um, in that time of need. And things have been going quite well on this project. Anderson also pointed to the Curry Road project, which he said will save the county roughly $200,000 by keeping the repair work in-house. He said things are going well with the Fur Road project, and if that continues, he estimates a completion date of April 2024. In Washington County, Jasmine Steverson, The Delta News.